Guess you are wondering what famous athletes do with all the money they make. From Mike Tyson's White Tiger to Terrell Owens' Multiple Mansions, some of the most famous names in sports have been known to spend their hard-earned money in some of the strangest ways. In this video, we will talk about 15 bizarre ways athletes have spent their money, from extravagant purchases to seemingly senseless investments. Starting off with the strange things athletes spend money on. When it comes to athletes and celebrities, nothing is off-limits when it comes to spending money. From exotic cars and jewelry to outrageous mansions, these athletes seem to have no limit when it comes to spending money. Here are some of the most ridiculous things athletes spend their money on. Gilbert Arenas Shark Infested Mansion Former NBA All-Star Gilbert Arenas has made headlines for some of his outrageous spending habits. One of his most outrageous purchases was a massive mansion in Malibu, California. Not only was the mansion extravagant, but it also came with its own shark tank, complete with live sharks. The mansion reportedly cost Arenas $3 million and included a full-sized basketball court, a 20-seat theater, and a 1,000-square-foot master bedroom. The mansion also featured an indoor pool and a waterfall, but the highlight of the mansion was the shark tank, which apparently cost Arenas $2 million. On the list is Michael Jordan Elephant Print Paint Job Michael Jordan is known for his love of cars, and one of his most outrageous purchases was a custom-painted Ferrari with an elephant print paint job. The car was reportedly painted in the colors of his alma mater, the University of North Carolina. The paint job cost Jordan a reported $6 million and featured an elephant print pattern on the hood and side sides of the car. The car also featured a custom interior with Jordan's signature logo on the headrest and a custom leather steering wheel. This extravagant purchase was just one of many for Jordan, who is known for his love of cars and his passion for collecting them. We also have Mike Tyson's Bengal Tigers. Mike Tyson is known for his love of exotic animals, and one of his most outrageous purchases were two Bengal Tigers. The Tigers were reportedly purchased in the 1990s, and it's believed that Tyson paid more than $140,000 for the two tigers. Tyson reportedly kept the tigers at his home in Southington, Ohio, where he also had a pet liger, a cross between a lion and a tiger and a pet alligator. While Tyson eventually sold the tigers, he kept the liger and alligator for many years. Next, Antonio Gray Hello Kitty Smart Car appears at number 13. Former NFL player Antonio Garay made headlines when he purchased a Hello Kitty themed smart car. The car was reportedly customized with a Hello Kitty wrap and was complete with a Hello Kitty steering wheel and seats. The car also featured a Hello Kitty themed sound system and a custom license plate. Garay reportedly paid $60,000 for the car, which was a a gift to his daughter. The car was one of a kind and was reportedly the only Hello Kitty themed smart car in the world. Also, Chris Johnson's gold teeth. Former NFL running back Chris Johnson made headlines when he purchased a set of gold teeth. Johnson reportedly paid $15,000 for the gold teeth made from 18 karat white gold. Johnson said the gold teeth were a way to show my personality. Johnson isn't the only athlete to invest in gold teeth. Other athletes, such as rapper Lil Wayne and former NBA star Shaquille O'Neal, also have gold teeth. While it may seem like an outrageous purchase, it's one way for athletes to show off their wealth and their unique style. Next, Chad Johnson's Fish Tank Bed Former NFL wide receiver Chad Johnson is known for his outrageous spending habits. One of his most outrageous purchases was a fish tank bed. The bed reportedly cost Johnson $50,000 and featured a built-in aquarium with live fish. The bed also featured a built-in lighting system and a sound system that was designed to lull Johnson to sleep. While the bed may 
have been an extravagant purchase, Johnson reportedly said it was one of the best investments he had ever made. Next, Reggie Jackson's Antique Car Collection Reggie Jackson, former Major League Baseball outfielder and designated hitter, is known as much for his passion for cars as his baseball career. Jackson's collection of classic muscle cars is estimated to be well over 100, with some of the vehicles he owns being worth as much as $200,000. Unfortunately, around 30 cars belonging to Jackson were destroyed in a warehouse fire that occurred in 2015, and the losses from the fire were estimated to be around $3.2 million. Despite this setback, Jackson has continued growing his collection and owns some truly unique and expensive classic cars. Also, Bryant McKinney's $100 million bar tab. Former NFL player Bryant McKinney once ran up a $100 million bar tab at an exclusive Los Angeles nightclub. McKinney ordered 15 bottles of expensive champagne in addition to other drinks. Reports suggest that he used a credit card to foot the bill, but it is unclear if he ever paid it in full. Despite this incredibly large bar tab, McKinney continued his professional football career until he retired in 2016. And next is Marquise Daniels' 3D necklace of himself. Former NBA player Marquise Daniels may have one of the most bizarre ways of spending his money on a custom diamond-encrusted replica of his own head. This piece, which was created by the popular jeweler Jason of Beverly Hills is made using a 3D laser imaging process with over 1,300 grams of 14K gold and flawless black, white, and cognac diamonds. The cost of this extravagant custom piece has not been disclosed, but it looks to be at least a six-figure amount. Lionel Messi makes it to the list over his action toward his noisy neighbors. Living next to a noisy neighbor can be incredibly frustrating. Unfortunately, Lionel Messi, the famous Argentine football star, found himself in this situation. In 2011, Messi bought a mansion in the Castel de Fels municipality of Barcelona. He soon discovered that his neighbors were a bit too noisy for his liking. So, to settle the case, he bought their houses to add to his estate for an unknown amount. Lionel Messi isn't the only one who's been known to drop some serious cash on all Odd items. As coming next on our list is the $1.65 million gambling day for John Daly. John Daly is one of the most well-known professional golfers of all time. However, his career has been plagued by various personal issues, including battles with alcohol and drug addiction, smoking, and excessive weight gain. Among his vices, however, gambling might be the biggest. In particular, he has reportedly lost between 50 and 1.65 million dollars in a single day of gambling. That amount of money is especially remarkable when you consider that Daly made an estimated 10 million dollars throughout his entire professional golfing career. In addition to his gambling, Daly is also well known for his outrageous fashion choices. He's been seen wearing a tuxedo while golfing and frequently wears his trademark brightly colored pants. While his wardrobe has been met with criticism, he is unapologetic about his style and continues to dress according to his own taste. And next is the paint job of Darius Miles. Darius Miles owns a 1975 Pontiac Bonneville on 30-inch wheels, but that isn't even the weirdest part. A painting of Benjamin Franklin with a lit joint in his mouth is on the passenger side of the hood. Miles also spent thousands of dollars on upgrading the engine and exterior of the vehicle. He added special wheels, a custom paint job, and an interior to match his eccentric style. The car is a strange mix of old and new, and is a testament to Miles' unique personality. At number 4, Vince Young's 
$15,000 at the Cheesecake Factory. Among the most unfortunate consequences of a football career is that an athlete can always spend more money, regardless of their salary, which may include splurging on $15,000 at the Cheesecake Factory. In an interview with Sports Illustrated, Young claimed to have never before spent that much money on a meal. Third on the list, Scotty Pippen gets a lemon airplane. After acquiring a Gulfstream jet, the second most famous member of the Chicago Bulls from the Michael Jordan era, discovered $1 million in work that needed to be done on it before it could take off, according to a report by the Sports Drop. Faced with such a high cost, Pippen sold the plane for only $4.3 million and bought himself a rather odd replacement, a yellow Citroen CX airplane with two seats and no cabin, which cost him around $250,000 at the time. In an interview with ESPN's Jackie McMullen, Pippin talked about his unusual purchase, saying that it was just so funny looking, like something out of the Flintstones he couldn't resist. He noted that it was a great plane for getting around town and going on short trips, but he wanted something bigger for his family, so he sold it for almost what he had paid for it. Number 2. Shaquille O'Neal's Custom Superman Bed In addition to being the biggest center in history at 7 feet tall and 300 pounds, Shaq required a spacious bed. His Superman-inspired 15 by 30 foot bed measured about 450 square feet in size, and there is 100 square feet less square footage than an average New York studio apartment. The bed frame was made of 4x6 lumber, with layered plywood covered with latex foam rubber. It was also decorated with superhero graphics that had been applied with an airbrush. Furthermore, four 5-inch television screens were mounted at its foot, where he could watch his favorite shows from bed. The headboard was lined with speakers, so he could listen to music. Even more interesting was its $500 remote control that allowed him to move the mattress into different positions, from sitting up to lying down and propping up his legs. To this day, it remains the most unique piece of furniture ever owned by a celebrity athlete. Finally, on the list, is Terrell Owens' Electronic Bingo. A GQ interview with former NFL wide receiver Terrell Owens in 2012 revealed he had lost almost all of the $80 million he earned in his career due to bad investments and real estate collapse. In addition to those bad investments, T.O. lost $2 million when he invested in an Atlanta entertainment complex with bingo machines. His financial advisor ended up being sued for suggesting Owens invest in the venture. From gold-plated cars and diamond-encrusted jewelry to life-sized aquariums and shark-infested mansions, what do you think should have been added to the list? What are some of the most ridiculous and stupidly expensive things athletes spend their money on? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more content like this.